where have we been? Sorry. <sighs> well, yeah, it don't make money off YouTube. If we ever get to, who knows? Um, that's our goal in YouTube. But, um, since we don't make money off of it, we've had some family we've that have had some problems and um, like ones in a nursing home and anyway we've had kind of just things like that that trumped not making money off YouTube now if it makes us money and it's a job as far as income yeah we would feather off like that but we did so I'm sorry that. Come on. Foot up. Come on. Let's go. Pick your foot up. Um. Come on. Pick your foot up. Come on. Move it. Come on. There we go. But I'm just being honest. Um. No, this way, Violet. Since. It's not yet a money-making thing for our family income. It does take a little different of a... Um... Woo! Riding your bike! So, trying to be of assistance to family has also kind of got us behind on schooling. And so we're picking up on that this summer to get some key points taken care of. But what's going on right now? We'll catch you up in this video. Isn't that a beautiful baby? What is he to us now? Whoa, hey, don't get so close. What are you? This is Dale. Okay, not being cooperative at all. So this is just our catch up video. Let's see how Violet does without being tied. Dale, it was a bottle baby. He is now got a new mama. His mama died prolapse. Uh, basically, it was pretty bad. I think she died pretty instantly, but it was like an inside out kind of bad scenario. So, <laughs> he is hungry. He was skinny. Still he is. Come on, baby. Oh, let's see. No, just let's see. Let's see. This is our first time not being tied. Ah, Violet. So this is one project we've got going on. It's going okay, even though you just saw that. This is her. I'm trying to make it where I can put her in here, go strain the milk come back the deed be done of him nursing her down we're leaving a court i mean a quarter this is her second time having a nurse calf uh, being a nurse cow and so she's on good grass we're right now in another project we cleaned this up where our solar panels needed more sunlight even though that's still a failure and we still have this bottom half to clean up and grow grass. But this is our first fenced-in area for a cow or a calf on our new place. Now, we've been here three years, but it was all woods. We've got the other spot that we cleared up quite a bit, which is... Um, was full of bamboo at one spot. Not all of it. I say full of bamboo. I had... Thick bamboo, had trees, you know, little small ones. We've opened up sunlight and all this stuff. So anyway, we are fencing in stuff. Sorry we have not caught all this up. We also have a garden um, that we were, our hopes were, till everything kind of got behind schedule and crazy was to show you like us doing that, getting it planted, all this kind of stuff. But we're back. And, um reprioritizing so help us make our channel grow and 
make it more of a priority with eventually if we can get to a financial gain on here we can definitely put more time and effort into it but we have to put effort into things that our family really prospers from before at this point so make youtube prosperous for us all right our daily walk with violet here is our garden the darker spots that's what we've composted or i mean so we put compost on we have our bees over here still going and not all the kids have yet checked the bees with me but jc did it's horse fly season and i hate it it's like the most evil time of year Oh, hate it. It's snake season. But this is the area we've been cleaning up. See how pretty this has, that's starting to look? I'll show you more as we go down this way. So, Tyler put right there, and right down here, the front corner post. Yes, we'll hay it real good so it can seed itself. We'll probably cut a few more small trees, like right over there, to open it up more for more sunlight. But this is our daily pilgrimage. Um, when we get this fenced in, we won't have to make it as much. But this gives her time with her friend cows. And good exercise for us and the kids silas practicing his bike <sighs> look at him whoa way to recover you did it hunter and dog. cookie hey how dog. they have grown this is my dog named hunter yes hey. This is our puppies, how they have grown. So, <laughs> they're a ton, yes, Hunter's a talker, Cookie barks at the calf, and, and Hunter barks at the trash can. And they are gonna soon be in training for obedience by the kids. Watch where you're walking, and they're also needing to learn not to poop close to the house. Doing that is because they're learning their instincts. Yeah. And they don't know how to be trained. If your dog are trained, eh, just call me. <laughs> we hadn't worked with them with much yet. No, don't do that. We'll work with them, but that's not how. All right, so what about our no spin challenge? We're probably going to just update that um, quarterly. Quarterly. Quarterly updates for our no spin challenge is what we're going to do more than likely, maybe you know bi monthly or something. But we're gonna uh, we're continuing that our no spin. Gosh, groceries have gone up. Who's with me? Like gosh. But we're gonna continue on Bard Acres Farm with our simple living, uh, where we just try to find more ways to live simply. So through like homeschooling. Thumbs up button. Yeah, go ahead and do all that stuff. We're trying to grow here. But we're going to also still explore our minimalism. We're going to try cleaning hacks. Just all sorts of stuff as they come to us. I think we would probably be considered like a blog. Or a vlog. Like a video blog. Whatever they call it. I don't know. I'm not really up to date with all that stuff. But we're going to work on this year doing things. Uh, and building off of them such as picking our blackberries wild. We've done a bunch of huckleberries this year. And our garden, we're going to preserve it. I got a crock, finally. So, we're going to just work through preserving as much food as possible and um, trying to cut down on grocery costs and still working on our electricity costs going down. We have got it down, but we're about to go right back up with that air conditioner that just kicked on. Here's my best picture I have. So... 
Stay tuned. See where we go. And Join us. Come along with and, us. And watch more episodes of Dad's Farm, JC's Farm, and Sauce's Farm. Borrowed Acres Farm. But viewers, I cannot even believe this. I forgot to show you our baby chickens an update video on life. And I don't even show you what's going on on our farm with our chickens. Okay. This little lady started laying on eggs last night. This little lady hatched us these. She's going to do great. Uh, she was born last year. We got six from her. She was born last year. So this broody business is paying off. This is the earliest we've ever had any hatch. Um, they are over a month old. She's going to hatch us these in three weeks. And so if they keep up, we might actually get up to four which would be our biggest total ever of being hatched. So, stay tuned. We'll be able to show you what happens with our beautiful chicks and chickens. And hopefully, those are all hens. What are the odds of that? I mean, we can wish, can't we?